Hello guys, welcome to the seventh tutorial of the series I'm Vivek and in this tutorial we are going to learn about copy command that is cp command. Many a times you might be need required to copy one file to another file or one copy taking backup of one uh, file which is important to you or copying it to various location. So all those things you're going to learn in this tutorial. All right. So we created a file called Vivek and we copied it to Anurag using cat command. But the simpler way would be <coughs> just type cp Vivek and we'll name it as Vivek dot back that is backup. It created another file called Vivek dot bak here. So <coughs> the syntax is simple cp source file name and the destination file name now it becomes little complex when the location is not the same now suppose i need to copy vivek from current location to a location inside linux directory so we'll type cp vivek i'll copy here at the current location then under that we have a linux directory and copy here now, what happened nothing is visible here let's go inside linux directory and we see that vivek is existing here and it just got created the time is 320 pst just got created all right let's go back to the parent directory that is cd and then two dots that means take the parent directory Let's clear the screen. Let's see what all directories are here. All right. Now we have a file called Vivek inside Linux directory. We need to copy it to Linux one directory. The file exists under Linux directory. It has to copy it under Linux one directory. Again, it's simple. CP command. Under current directory, we have a Linux directory where we have a file called Vivek. Now it has to be copied to Linux 1 directory or maybe Linux 2 directory. Alright. And if you want to name something else, so new Vivek, it will copy the file as new Vivek. Let's see what happened. Let's go inside CD Linux 2 and we got our new Vivek file here. What's the content of new Vivek? Yeah. Let's see what was here. Cat Vivek. So the content remains the same. Okay, now we have a directory called Linux, Linux 1, Linux 2, Linux 3. What's inside Linux 3? Do we have something? No, we don't have anything. Now we need to copy the content of Linux 1 into Linux 3. Now how to copy that? So we'll type copy command and we will add a switch called minus R that is recursively. Source directory that is Linux 1, copy it to destination directory that is Linux 2. All right, let's go to Linux 2. Let's see. New Vivek is there. Did we have Linux? Did we have it under Linux 1? No, we did not have. Okay. Let's copy Linux 2 content to Linux 1 then because we don't have anything under Linux 1. We'll go to the parent directory present working directory that is pwd is home student and we have student uh, linux 1 linux 2 linux 3 and so on we need to copy linux 2 content to linux 1 we'll go we'll copy linux 2 to linux 1 we'll go to linux 1 and see Okay, we have Linux 2 copied here. CD Linux 2. 
and under Linux 2 we have the file new Vivek and Linux 1 that all actually existed under Linux 2 directory so this is how we copied the directory cool so I hope you learned how to use cp command in next tutorial we'll try to learn more about mv command that is move command all right thanks for watching this tutorial guys keep doing side by side while you are learning that will ensure you're not forgetting these things thanks for watching